in Ideal Cooking in Carla's Kitchen today, we're uh, stuffing a pork loin roast. And um, to help reduce the calories and to make this a little more healthy, I made my stuffing out of quinoa. So on my website, you'll see the recipe for stuffing made with quinoa. Okay, and I love this stuffing. Um, I've always made it with breadcrumbs, but I found that I can substitute this and make it a little more healthy and it's still really tasty. So all you do is take a pork loin roast. I got mine um, in a package, Swift pork tenderloin. Costco has them bigger than this. This was five pounds, which is plenty big. I'll get done with this, it'll, it'll serve 10. So with the stuffing and the pork loin. Um, so I'm gonna put stuffing on one side. The other side I'm gonna sprinkle with this um, Cavender's all-purpose Greek seasoning, like this on the on pork. Um, so I'm going to sprinkle just a little bit on that. And I'm going to put that over the top, like that. That's how it looks. And then we're going to take some butcher string, and we're just going to simply tie it up so it stays together. So while it cooks, there's a little bit. So, that, it's a good looking roast. And then, just take some of the string, tie it. I like to just keep tying it around this. And then, oh yeah. Once I have it all tied, now I'm just going to show you the last part. I'm making my apple dessert today, so I had some um, cooked apples. And I like to put those on top of this. This one you'll see on the recipe is optional. It adds just a nice little flavor without a ton more calories. Um, it's just got because I make these sugarless, of course. We're going to bake that up. I'll show you what it looks like when it comes out of the oven and then when I plate it. And that's it.